Hey, 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 hey. It is a beautiful Monday, April 25th, 2021. Well, good morning and welcome, guys, to another edition of our morning announcements. Let's go ahead and get things crack a -lack. Alrighty then, guys. Well, our Pacer expectations, these are the things that we want to live by when we were here on campus. Hey, let's go ahead and say them together now. Hey, we choose to be respectful. We are responsible. We make right choices. And do we ever, ever give up? No way. That's why we are relentless. Cool beans right there. Well, today's joke of the day. It's a good knee slapper. Well, let's see here. You guys can help me out. Ready? Knock, knock. Cash. Cash, who? No, thanks. I prefer peanuts. <laughs> I get it. There's a cashew kind of nut, but there's peanuts. <laughs> Ooh, that's a pretty good one right there, y'all. Okay, okay. Well, we have some special birthdays in the house over the past few days here. Uh, no specific birthday today, but we have some birthdays over the past few days. We have Samantha. Ochoa, Williams, Cortez, and Audrey Harris, happy birthday to the three of you scholars. I hope that your day was special as uh, you get to celebrate your birthday. <clears throat> me, 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 me. Happy, happy birthday. Yes, it is. It was your birthday a few days ago. But hey, we will sing happy birthday. Happy birthday. All right, guys. Hope you guys had a sweet, delicious one. All right, guys, well, hey, we are going to extend our one-hour recess. Not really a competition, but just basically our one-hour, because we were supposed to have that last Friday. None of the classes quite made it. We had a few classes that had, like, three left. Some had, like, four left, and then some had, like, seven, eight, nine. So, hey, look, uh, we're, we're going to extend this opportunity out. Any class that gets 100, that's right, 100% of their class to sign the annual parent Notice, we'll get a one-hour recess this Friday. You say, well, what do I got to do? How do I get my parents to do it? There's two ways, guys. Scholars, you can either have your parents go on to the Parent Q Connect app, and they can do it there, or just have them come on down to the office, and they can the, the, the ladies can help them uh, right there. So we sent home a few flyers. It's got a, uh, it's got a cool QR code on there, which means that you can uh, get a tutorial video on how to do it. But um, it's actually pretty, pretty... Uh, quick when you do it, but um, all right, so anybody gets 100%, and of course, we're also uh, raffling off a uh, Target gift card for, for any teacher who also uh, gets the class to 100% right there. Speaking of extending, that man, we are we got a cool deal right here, guys, where we, we're able to extend our yearbook sale for one more week, so if you had any regrets, like, no! Now you could be like, yes, <laughs> twenty dollars, guys. Sale will end this Friday for reals. Now, guys, guys, it looks so amazing and so awesome. I think I may even have to do a few little bit of a sneak preview, right? Okay, maybe tomorrow, guys, I'll do a little sneak preview. But it is looking awesome. So much time and efforts that I put into it. I hope you guys will go and get one for twenty dollars. Make me want to holla. There will be no patient productions this Wednesday, April twenty seventh. All right, so normally on Wednesdays, the club meets from 2 to 4, uh, but it will not be meeting this Wednesday. There is no nada, 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 no picture productions. But yes, it will be on for today on Monday and Tuesday after school. All right, guys, well, last week was great. We had our BMX uh, assembly, and this week, man, what we're, we're going to have another treat as the mobile dairy classroom is coming to Almond. It is going to be so awesome, guys, an opportunity, guys, to, to interact with these awesome cows and learn more about uh, the great w ways that cows um, tell them, like, help us. In our, um, and so, hey, check out this short video that we can kind of see a, a little bit of what's going on there. Fields of green dotted with cattle quietly grazing. A blue-collar image of rural American life. 
but nowadays one rarely seen by most people. In fact, many modern school children may not even know where milk and other dairy products come from and the role they play in a healthy, nutritious diet. And despite the large number of cows in the Golden State, most residents never have the chance to interact up close with our bovine friends. That is, unless the cows come to you. And that's what these kids are experiencing at this elementary school in Rancho Cordova, outside Sacramento. This is one of six mobile dairy classrooms traveling the state, bringing the farm to the classroom for nearly a half million youngsters each year. Are you ready to be a special guest? Okay. Today, the kids are meeting Snickers, a five-year-old, 1,500-pound Holstein cow, then the highlight, a chance to see and pet a cat. Instructor Kimberly Newman says she's been managing these kid and cow and puffers for five years, meetings that never get old. And I think it's absolutely perfect for me. To actually see the light bulb go off, that they can see a connection between an actual dairy cow and the milk that is in their cafeteria. And that agriculture provides all of the food they eat when it comes to all five food groups. It's all right there in front of them. I think it was amazing. The first time I ever seen a cow. All right, guys. Well, as you get to see on the screen, the preschool, TK, kinder, first and second grade will be going at 8 a.m. on the blacktop and then 3rd through 6th grade at 8.45 a.m. So we'll see you guys out there at that time. So, all righty, guys. Well, that is this edition of our morning announcement. Let's go ahead and make it a great day or not. The choice is always yours. Be you.